This is the tiger tempo. Start with our left foot back and our hands up on guard. We're going to slide back into a half stance, walking across our body. We're going to take a big slide forward and do a crane strike to the stomach, followed by a palm strike to the stomach. Kind of reach up and grab their forehead, pulling their head back as we hit them with a chop. Let's do it again. So, we're going to slide into our cat stance as we block across our body. Slide out, do a crane strike, followed by a palm strike. Reach up, grab their head, tilt their head back, and do a chop. One more time. Slide and back. Come forward. One, two, three. And if we did that at regular speed, we're going to try to put all those strengths together. I also want to go over the footwork on that with you. This footwork is going to be the same for the dragon. So tiger and dragon, are going to, we're going to do the same footwork. So your foot's going to step back, and then the other one is going to slide in. And then they both slide forward. Back foot steps back, front foot slides in to your cat stance, and then they both slide forward. Let's try that again. Take a nice slide. You want to be, you want the person to now be in your center so you can go through with these strikes and then just reach up and chop. You could either grab their forehead or you could grab their hair on their head and pull their head back a little bit when you do that chop. Next, we're going to do the dragon tempo. The dragon, we do the same start, where we step back and slide into a cat stance, but now our block is different. We're doing a number three block. After we do our block, we're going to slide forward and put our hand just right against their arm, and we're going to spin around so that we're all the way behind them now. We're going to do an elbow strike to their back and a tiger claw to their groin. And pretend like we're grabbing their groin. We're going to jump up. And we hit them with a palm at the end that's going that way to the back of their head. Let's try that again. So we start with our hands up. We do the same footwork where we take that little step back with our left, and we do a cat stance with our right, and we block, and then we step out, we spin all the way around behind them. So right now we're back to back with them. We do an elbow strike to their back, and then we do a tiger claw to their groin. We pretend that we're grabbing their groin. We jump up, and when we finish, we're going to do a palm strike. We jump up, and then palm strike. And the palm strike goes right to the back of their head. Dragon, block, spin around, elbow, claw, block, spin around, elbow, claw, Next, we're going to do the crane. We do a downward block and we grab their wrists as we pull and shuffle behind them. And we do a back kick and a back fist. And then we get all the way behind them. I'm going to show you the right side here. Block, grab, pull, lift up your arm and your leg. You want to hit them in the back of the head as you kick their leg. Do that again. So back of the head and back of the knee. Block, grab, we pull and we move to the side of them. We lift up our leg. We're hitting them in the back of the knee and the back of the head. And then we're coming up here behind them. When you get a little better at it, you can block and you can just kind of jump when you do it like this. And the crane. Hi -ya! Hi -ya! 